Hey everybody, so in this video I'm going to do the mirror effect nails. So you're going to need an exacto knife and a CD, an old one. Um, just cut two vertical lines and then two horizontal lines. Try to get as close as possible to that little circle in the middle. Um, make sure you cut them deep enough to where it'll cut the film. Let's see right there and then do the other side. And then um, you're going to need some tweezers so you can lift the film. Like it lifts easily but it'll break off like into little pieces or tear or whatever. That's fine because you're going to cut it up anyways. As you can see I use my tweezers to lift, to lift it and then it tears but that's fine. Try to get as many big pieces as possible but if, if it's in little pieces that's okay because you're going to cut it up anyways. So I'm going to lift this one, take that one off, and you can see it has like a mirror effect. Uh, and then um, um, just keep on doing that till you do the whole thing, and then you can cut up the pieces. But um, what I'm going to use is I'm going to use a base coat, top coat, and gel polish. So I'm still peeling it up. As you can see and then now just get some scissors in a little container and cut up the pieces however you want in little triangles or whatever you want to do however you want them to come out I just cut it up like crazy just cut and cut and cut until you get all little pieces you can leave some big ones and you can have some really tiny ones so you can get into the little corners of the nails So just keep cutting. Um, you could also you just hold it with the tweezers like that, cause and then um, when when you're holding it with your fingers, you leave fingerprints on the little film part, and you don't want that, cause you're gonna put it in the nail and you're gonna be able to see the little fingerprint. So just keep cutting until you get all these little pieces, and then you can with all the leftovers you can save them in a little container. That way you can use it on somebody else's nail or another set. So here I'm doing a base coat. Um, this finger had acrylic on it, so I'm just going to cover it up with base coat. And then I cured it, and then I'm going to do a black polish, gel polish. I did three coats, so you're going to cure the first two coats, and then when you do another coat, don't cure it, because you can cure it. I'm going to place the... Whatever we cut up, the mirrors... The little paper we cut up, I'm going to place them with the shiny side up, like the rainbow side. I'm just going to place them randomly on the nail. And this is before I cured the nail. So when you're done placing all of the little cut up pieces on the nail, you can cure it. That way it will cure with the with the little pieces on there. Um, I'm also using a wax pencil because I found it easier to lift and to press down with. So just place them randomly however you want and fill in the little spaces with smaller pieces. You can put them however you want. I'm just putting them on the nail. And this is the first time I do this. I wanted to try this out. Uh, let me know if y'all like this and if y'all try it out. Just let me know how it went in the comments down below. I think it gives it a really pretty effect with the black and then the shiny rainbow. It does sort of look like mirror, like glass pieces. Um, it looks cool. I love the way it looks. I want to try it with uh, just the clear nail. See how that'll look. So make sure you put them on the nail and just press a little down. That way they can stick. And then after you're fine with how they look, uh, cure it in the, um, in the LED lamp for 30 seconds or UV for 3 minutes. So that's how mine's came out like this. I'm going to cure it. Oh, I'm still putting a little bit of pieces like where the empty spaces are. So that's how it looks so far. It looks cute. I think it gives it a pretty effect. I also want to try this with like a holographic glitter base. So cure it for 30 seconds 
in the UV, in the LED and then you're gonna do the top coat after it cures do the top coat then I did the top coat but it didn't record I lost that piece I don't know how but and then just take a a nail wipe with alcohol and wipe off the tacky layer and you're done this is how it looks look how beautiful that looks it looks so pretty I could have filled in more of the black but I wanted to leave a little black showing I don't know I think it looked pretty like that but that's how it looks um look how beautiful it is even the glitter like you can see the little hollow holographic effects so thanks for watching everybody I hope you all enjoyed this video don't forget to like comment and subscribe and I'll see you on my next video bye